This is Google Cloud for VMware Admins. Next up, an overview of Cloud Concepts. In this video, we will provide an overview of some typical as a service offerings you may find in public cloud. But first, we'll start at the beginning with on-prem or on-premises IT. For many people, their first exposure to traditional IT would be from servers located on the company premises. It was common to buy a server for every application or service that the business used, but this soon got hard to manage. Then VMware changed the game for everyone, and virtualization and VMs became the norm on Intel and AMD platforms. Soon, simple virtualization became the software-defined data center with vSAN, NSX, and VMware Cloud Foundation. Cloud providers could now take VMware Cloud Foundation to extend the data center to become a 100% compatible hybrid cloud. For customers who wanted to move an Oracle database with strict licensing rules, Burn Metal on Cloud also became an option. For traditional VM workloads, Cloud can provide VM instances that provide much the same functionality, just on a different hypervisor. And if managing and securing operating systems is time consuming, containers and Kubernetes allows you to focus on applications instead. It's also possible to package an application in a container that is always running but only pay for it whilst it's actually being used. Or write an application specifically for a cloud provider's PaaS platform and not even worry about the dependencies. Or split out an application into smaller functions and only pay for the actual number of times it runs and the microseconds it takes. And for some services, such as email, storage, chat, sales forecasting and many others, you could just consume software as a service. You have been watching Google Cloud for VMware Admins.